Good morning, everybody. Hope you're okay today. Welcome along to Tuesday, the final Tuesday of the school year. Your learning target today is to learn Year 5 vocabulary for the term. Now, the words on the left-hand side are Year 5, 6 appropriate vocabulary, and I have created another sound file for you to click on to, which is here where it says how to say the words that you can click and you can listen precisely to how you pronounce the words individually. There's a small gap in between each word so you can practice as well. So click on that link there on the left hand side of that yellow rectangle to find out how to say the words. So on the right hand side um, there's a link to dictionary.com so you can find out the definitions of what the words are as well. OK, so the first thing you need to do today, spend a good 10 minutes or so pronouncing the words, saying the words and begin to find out what those words mean. When you're happy with this, when you know what they mean, you know how to say them. What you then can do is uh, turn over to this page here and you can start to think about how you can apply these new words to hopefully Kenzuki's kingdom. Now what I've done is I've tried to find an example from the whole text, so not just for one individual chapter, but for the whole text for how these words can be used, can be replicated to describe something from Kenzuki's kingdom. Okay, starting at the top with pronunciation, down to the bottom with sacrifice. The very best and the most hardest work students should be able to do that without too much difficulty. If you want, what you can do is you can write a sentence that is nothing at all to do with Kenzuki's kingdom. That's OK for one or two of the words if you really, really cannot think what they mean. I appreciate restaurant is quite a difficult one to write about when it comes to Kenzuki's kingdom because there is not a single restaurant on the island to eat dinner. So just be a little bit creative with these if you want to. As long as they make sense... They don't actually need to, to be true. I just want to know that you understand what the words mean and that you can pronounce them OK. All right. So, for example, maybe uh, Kenzuki can open a sushi restaurant on the island. I don't know. Just thinking up things off the top of my head here. All right. So what we're doing today is we're learning year five vocabulary from the term. There are nine words for you to have a practice at uh, speaking and also recording and hopefully learning. You can see the words on the left hand side of the screen now. You can find out how to say the words and also what the words mean by clicking onto this slide. OK, very best of luck, boys and girls. Miss Halls and I will see you a little bit later on. Thank you.